Hello Aquarius, welcome to Beardly Two Tarot and this reading is from 1st of March to 7th of March. So let's check what are the messages for you in this week. Messages for Aquarius, what you can expect in this week. Three of Swords. Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Swords, Two of Pentacles, and the Fool. Okay, Aquarius. With this Ten of Swords, your person is realizing that they have made the worst mistake this time. I don't know what has happened between you two, but uh, with this Ten of Swords, looks like something really complicated, something really messy. And um, this person is in pain now. You see here, this beautiful doll, the perfect doll, is uh, cut here, I mean, <laughs> I'm talking about this cake. And um, this person is now in panic. They are panicking um, about ruining everything. This person is thinking what they have done or what has happened by mistake. So maybe this person said something and now they are regretting. They want to take their words back. They want to uh, undo something. But with this Ten of Swords, this person is feeling after what they have done or what they have said, everything is over. We have the Three of Swords here. So certainly this person feels like something has ended forever and uh, this is irreversible. This person knows that they have hurt you badly. This Ten of Swords is not only about them, but it's also about you. They know that uh, they have hurt you badly this time and um, you know, they know that you are now thinking once again about being in this relationship. Probably many of you have already separated and uh, this person is feeling that uh, now they cannot do anything to save this relationship. With this two of pentacles, this person knows that uh, even if they say something or do something, it won't be enough. You will still doubt them because two of pentacles is all about confusion. Two of pentacles is about um, not knowing what to trust and what to not. So with this Knight of Pentacles, this person will now give you something that you have been asking for, for so long. This could be commitment, this could be some kind of promise, this could be some kind of transformation that you wanted in them. This person will try to show that they are now ready for it. They are now ready to give you whatever you want, but they are aware that uh, maybe it's too late and um, you are done with this Ten of Swords. You are not going to trust them once again. Though, they would still take a chance because here we have the Fool. So nothing can stop this person. Seems like this is someone who is really enthusiastic, who is really uh, brave whenever it, uh, it is about confessing their feelings or taking a risk. They don't think much about what would be the consequence. And um, that is what gives them this courage. So no matter what has happened, in spite of having three of swords and ten of swords and two of pentacles, this person would still approach and um, may make you feel that uh, they are pushing you for something. Okay, you doesn't seem to have... Um, moved on from that point or you doesn't seem to have healed you may feel like you need some more time but then again they will be knocking at your door they might call you they might text you they may want to see you and um, they would want it once again okay but this card of fool they will again say something um to surprise you you will be like okay after doing this to me after ruining it so much you still have this courage to ask me out or you still have this courage to um, give me a promise that probably you are going to break once again 
so a lot may happen in this week and um, you won't know how to react though the tarot is not uh, telling you to react it's um, about taking some time to process your feeling to know what you want at this point because getting out of this ten of swords energy is important here it's not something that you can force uh, it's something that will happen naturally so if you feel that you want some time take it however this is a general reading um, it may not resonate with everyone the energy could be reverse as well also you can check your moon and rising sign let's go ahead and check some more messages for you five of wands queen of swords eight of wands ace of pentacles and three of wands so here we have five of wands with this five of wands aquarius it's about getting over everything okay um i see that you would try to walk away from this person you would try to walk away uh, as far as possible i mean i see that you are looking for that point where nobody can reach you or nobody can see you seems like you are looking for some time alone this queen of swords is done she is hurt and now she wants to figure out uh, what she can do to fix herself you may have this feeling that you can run away uh, from this person or you can hide somewhere. But, uh, you know, this person will still follow you. Here you see this dragon. It's still there. And uh, no matter where this girl goes, even if it is uh, the top of the mountain, the dragon is still entangled to her. So, this is going to be uh, a bit frustrating. This person wants something from you. Here you see this woman giving those uh, fruits to the dragon. So, simply, whatever this person wants from you, they want to take it. And this card is about some kind of obsession that this person may show. Okay? They will try to talk to you even if you... Uh, do not receive their call a thousand times this person will again call you and this queen of swords is someone who is determined to do whatever she wants to so you may not feel like picking up their call or replying their text but they will still push you because they know you are this queen of swords they know that um, they have given you a good reason to be stubborn or to be upset and uh, they will have to face it with this eight of wands if you are single or if you are actually looking to move on you people may find someone new in this week you may meet someone who will feel like the perfect one for you okay you have been here in this darkness for a long time but is there darkness i mean we have a lot of light here but maybe you have closed your eyes. That's why you cannot see the light here. It's about um, opening up your eyes and uh, seeing around what else is there. With this Ace of Pentacles, many of you may feel that finally you got something you have been looking for. Now, Ace of Pentacles is not always about getting the relationship you're looking for or you wanted. It's about... Um, getting something that your soul needs so probably this break would feel better than you expected this uh, cut off or this um, walking away from them will feel better you would feel that uh, you have finally gained your strength or you have uh, some time for yourself because with the three of wands i again see you climbing this top of tree so that you can stay away from others so probably having some me time will be perfect for you in this week let's check an oracle message for you messages for aquarius star seed what lights you up so many of you could be star seeds you are here to do some kind of work for everyone or for humanity 
star seed is about focusing on your energy so that you can help others and uplift others so it's it should be your priority to heal yourself to love yourself because that is what others crave for or that is what your purpose is to work on yourself and then to share your positivity with the world so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye